Hey everyone, how's it going? And welcome back to Pokemon Tower Defense Master Collector. Right guys, so in, in this episode, as always, we're going to start off by going over our collection. Obviously, we've completed our original collection. This is our shiny transfers collection where we're trying to recapture every single Pokemon in the game. I get enough for every single gender there is. Make sure that we get all the multi level 100 eventually. Um, and I think that's it, right? I don't know. Anyways, guys, so we're going to look at our fancy things that are fun to look at this thing. Um, so the EV trade did go through, like I said last episode, guys. Um, so you'll notice that there's less EV. Where are the where are the EVs? Oh, I can't even see the EVs where they were anymore. Oh, here. No, no, no. Here, yeah, here, over here. So I did reserve four of them for Espeons and Umbreons, and I did um, these. And so the, that leaves enough. That that means I just need three more EVs as of right now. Eventually, I'll need more when Leafeon and Glaceon get added, and if he plans to do six gen. But anyways, guys, this episode is going to be the AMA. Or Q&A, rather. I don't know what you... Thingy. Anyway, Q&A thingy, guys. So, last time I said I'd do a Q&A, and I want to answer these guys, these questions properly, so I'm going to take a little bit of time to answer these questions here. So, the first question, would you do any online Minecraft and what originally got you involved in PTD? Alright, so I'm going to answer the second part of that question first, because that seems more relevant. Um, I originally started playing PTD. The first day I started playing PTD was August 22nd, 2011, I believe, which is my 17th birthday. I had some friends over. They were playing. Uh, they were, and and then they had a, they had their laptop and they wanted to play some sort of I can't remember a game. It was pretty popular at the time. It was some sort of shooter strategy game. I can't remember what it was called. And so I was just like, ah, what should I do? Oh, I'll just search up tower defense games. Like, like tower defense games. Like that's that's it's always been a genre of games that I liked. And Pokemon tower defense. I was like, wait, what? Tower defense and Pokemon? And I started playing and I just played for the rest of the night. And I was like, this is amazing. <laughs> And so would I ever do any online Minecraft? Uh, yes, I do do online Minecraft. I play uh, relatively often on the Overcast Network Project Ari server, which lately has been becoming a lot more popular, although it's been around for a while. It's a very straight-up Minecraft vanilla PvP server. I play on there every now and then. Um, Alright, so <laughs> a lot of people have expressed interest in seeing me eat breakfast. Um, okay, so like, if you guys didn't catch it last episode as a joke, I said that I can, of course I can do whatever I want on my channel. If I wanted, I could make a series of me eating breakfast every morning. Um, so, if you guys really want to see me eat breakfast, it's not really breakfast right now, but after this video, I'm going to go put a shirt on and record myself eating a bowl of cereal. Hope you guys will be happy. <laughs> and you'll see that for part of this episode. Alright, next question. Uh, what is your job? I don't actually have a job. Um... I haven't actually ever had a real job. I have a, tons of volunteer experience. I was like student council president in high school. I was like first responder in high school. I was like, I, I did a lot of, I have a lot of experience like acting, like which actually gets you quite far. Cause like, oh, I'm work well in the group. You know, I'm a social person. <laughs> um, but I had never had a real job experience. Right now I'm, I'm, I'm enrolled in a program in a nearby university. Uh, healthcare assistant program, which is like the guys who work in the retirement homes. So that's something I could do. I I'm interested in science and biology, and I don't really want to do math. Although I'm not terrible at it, I just don't really want to do math for my future. If you're offered a chance to be on a YouTube partner, meaning you have to take off music from all your videos, would you comply? Uh, I technically am a YouTube partner. Basically, anyone can be a YouTube partner. I, I don't. It was a while ago. That actually changed a while ago. Um, but yeah, I I I, I am using actually royalty-free music now. So there's that, because I was afraid of having to take them all down. Um, have you ever played the main DS games? Which ones? Uh, no. I have only ever played... The only canon Pokemon game that I've ever, I have ever played is Pokemon Yellow, uh, the original one. I, I actually never, I don't think, actually... I do have them now, some of them. But the first portable system that I actually ever owned myself was a DS. Just a, like the straight-up DS one. Um, actually, it was, a, yeah, it was a DS Lite, whatever. Um, I never actually owned a DS, believe it or not, before, or a portable system before that. Um, I, my cousin actually, my cousins actually had, like, I think that was the first time I played video games, was, like, Super Mario Bros. on my cousin's NES, you know, and they had a Game Boy and then stuff. Like, I never actually played them myself. Um, but the Pokemon games I have played, I've played, like, the Pokemon Stadium ones, like, the N64 one, and there was also a GameCube one, I think. And I've also played Pokemon Puzzle League on the N64. I played a lot. N64 is fun. <laughs> um, when will you grow your mutton chops again? <laughs> um, this is asked by Nivet, who is somebody, uh, a friend of mine in real life. Um, 
So he, because I have the ability to grow a full luscious beard, he said that, hey, you should grow mutton chops. And uh, eventually, like, well, like the beard that I have right now, I've been growing for about two months, let's say. Um, but the beard that I had when I shaved mutton chops <laughs> was, um, I had actually been growing that for actually five or six months because that, months because I was growing it for a play, that, uh, the school play in high school, Almost Maine. Um, it's actually, I think it's actually the, the most performed uh, high school play in the entirety of, of America, the United States, etc. Um, I, and I, I was in this, it was a scene with like two guys, it, it, it was a scene where two guys supposedly fall for each other in air quotes, I'm using air quotes with my fingers, but obviously you can't see that, um, and it, it was just like sort of like a, a, a funny thing, it wasn't, it wasn't anything overly physical or anything, don't worry, if you guys have, if you guys have seen the play, you'll know what I'm talking about, anyways, it was pretty funny, and so I, I grew up my entire beard for like five months, and after that, I sort of shaved it out in, uh, <laughs> I don't know why I'm telling you guys this stuff. Whatever. <laughs> you guys asked. Uh, oh, you didn't really ask this, but oh well. I feel like I don't know why. Check. Anyways, so I shaved it out in phases. Like the first thing that I shaved it out was just like I just I think I just I shaved out the wolver I shaved it into Wolverine. So I had like the little whiskers, <laughs> and then I had like the gap in the chin. And then I eventually shaved the mutton chops, and I kept mutton chops for a while. And then I just had six sideburns. Six sideburns. Then I shaved them. Up. Anyways, um, where do you live generally? Uh, I live in Vancouver. Wait, I, wait a second. Was this question already asked? I feel like this channel, this question was asked. Anyways, <laughs> let's answer it again. Um, I live in the Vancouver area of British Columbia, Canada. I was born here. I've lived here for most of my life. However, um, apparently when I was one years old, like when I was in grade one, when I was in grade three. When I was in and when, and when I was in grade seven, I was in India. Um, my mom is Canadian, my dad is Indian, that's why. Um, I, and I guess other than that, I've lived here for most of my life, ex excluding like maybe one or two months, like in Seattle or other places. Other than that, I think I've been here for most of my life. Um, but yeah. Uh, what, and last question is, what is your what is your favorite and least favorite Pokemon? Pokemon. <laughs> um. Okay. Hmm, let's start with favorite, obviously. Okay, sorry, I keep touching the thingy because I'm trying to check the time. We're pretty good. We're running pretty good in time. I've been trying to rush through this a little bit, guys, because um, I'm just scared about the time. Anyways, uh, what is your favorite and least favorite Pokemon? So, as far as first gen goes, I hate to be all stereotypical, guys, but I would have to say Charizard <laughs> because he's freaking awesome. Uh, no, because he was always my starter of choice. Probably ever since like saw the anime and like I like I just like Charizard the best like you know he was like Char Charmander Char and then is then Char like Charmeleon was like an angsty teenager and then Charizard's like screw you buddy I forget about you and then he's like and then he's like I love you I love you Ash catch my Palutena and I just love that that was just awesome and Fire and he was just the coolest one Fire is the coolest of the three in my opinion water and wa water by water and grass I mean. Anyways, but after that, I think probably Arceus, just because of my nature. I not my nature, but just the way I think about things in general. Probably Arceus, because he just freaking can do anything. Arceus is so cool. What's my least favorite Pokemon? I don't really have one, but I would have to. I've been thinking about this for a while, and I would have to say Venonat, because they're so annoying when you're trying to grind for Dittos in PTD1, at least before the Unknown Cave was, cave was added. Every time you get a shiny in that place, it's always a Venonat. It's never a Ditto. <laughs> Anyways, guys, thank you for watching. Hope you've enjoyed this. A AMA Q&A little type thing. Hope you enjoyed a video of me eating breakfast. <laughs> Hope you've enjoyed the grind montage. Hope you've enjoyed- I'm getting kind of worked up. I'm gonna go eat a bowl of cereal now and record it. Thanks guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Now we'll catch you guys later.